Okay, this is Big Baby J, another episode of uh, Chrono Cross. Last episode, as you know, we went into the fog and got up onto a ghost ship. Turned out to be a pirate ship. So, we won our little fights. And that threw us in a hole. So, let's go ahead and find out what's going on now. Key duty is a big responsibility. You don't know who got the key. So now we gotta find out who has the key. So we can do some further exploring. Like always, we'll take these guys out. I wouldn't intend to do that, but oh well. This is what I wanted to do. All right, let's give it to her, Tim, this time around. Should have got some iron behind that battle. Uh, heck, I didn't ask for your help. But well, you needed it. Speed up just a little bit. Why not use the egg strike? We haven't used that, so let's use it.
And there you have it. Just like that. I believe in an eagle eye. Thanks for the help. Huh? Who are you? Oh, yeah. You're the landlubber doing the hole. But how did... I guess it doesn't matter now. So, where do you plan to go? A key? I have no idea who has it. Hmm. Wow, I got four of them. How about that?
Everybody getting a turn, I see. The last one is all yours, Surge. All yours. Excuse me. Oh, I got a gravity blow. Don't just stand there, oh, you land lovers. Help out. Sorry, I don't have the key. Okay, now you don't have the key either. Who has this key?
I love starting off with level three element attack. Excuse me, level three attack. The eagle eye helps me out quite a bit. If you haven't figured it out, it's pretty much my favorite element, my go-to element anyway. By the powers, how'd you guys get out? Ah, oh, forget it. We have more serious matters to worry about. Huh? Now what? You can't get through here? Must is all through over the deck. What? A key? Hey, mateys. Who on key duty? Oh, I am. You got it? Do you want the key for the floor downstairs, eh? Uh, I'm on key duty, but with all the chaos, I, uh, gave it to the nearest matey around me. I was such a panic, I don't quite remember who I gave it to. I'm sure he's down downstairs somewhere. Uh, great, now I gotta find somebody else with the key. Hmm. Going downstairs again. I'm gonna check everyone. Cause I ain't got time for all this. You got K duty, but you don't remember who you gave it to. Oh, this is getting crazy now. Somebody has a key. Oh. Ah, oh, because I left this one, huh? I would take him out with dash and slash. Let me let Glenn get a little action in on this.
Mm, aqua Ball. I guess you just use the key. I ain't fighting you. I got enough fights to deal with other than fighting you. No, don't drink that. It can it can heal you true enough, but I also can poison you. Oh great. Battle after battle after battle. Oh, this would be quick. So I thought. Yeah, this is definitely quick. Ah, I didn't see that one.
Now we gotta get Pip. Oh, crap. Oh, well. The other one need to be like that, too. Got Graviton. You know what? I'm about to go ahead and uh, experiment those tacos. Yeah, I'm about to experiment with those toggles. Figure out what is what. Cause right now I really don't know. you trying to catch hold a light I'm not gonna be using that I see a pip Come along. Nope, still can't join my party. I'm not worried about Pip. Get back in there. You got Photon Beam. I'll equip that shortly, but not right now. Let's go ahead and say the game. Now, let's continue on. Hey, just in time, mateys. 
Look out. There are too many of them. Are you call yourself sea dogs? Show some spirit. Huh? Look out. Captain, look out. Mateys, go help the captain. Get your stinking ghostly hands off me. All right, looks like we got a big one coming. Your name Serge, yeah? Go take the wheel. Aye, aye, Captain. I'm counting on you. Keep your heads high, mateys. Don't forget, we be the powers board the SS Invincible. Man your station, it's time to show these muscles what we're made of. Aye aye, Captain. Sirs, keep your head up high. They're coming. All right, Lena, you up next. And he's using diminish. Outstanding. I'm not using elements. It's going to be a physical fight. All right. Except for this right here. Wow, how about that? Now, what do you have that I can use? Nah, don't worry about it. Nah, use imbecile on you. I know it's black and I got the field all black and it's in his favor, but Let's hit you with a little white this time. Just get this feel out of all black.
Hmm. That's kind of like pushing it, ain't it? No, I don't want to use no elements with her. Just attack. That'll do it. And we got level five. Nice. Looks like the is back to normal. You said you were heading for Fort Dragonia to go after Viper and his men? Let me give you some advice. Mount Pyre is a fiery hell. Without any protection against fire, you lose strength fast. I suggest you go see the Water Dragon for this divine protection first. Although I haven't heard much about him recently, I wonder if that dragon's still alive. Actually, I haven't heard much about the other dragons either. And those monsters we just beat. What's going on nowadays? I tell you, even the sea seems to have changed its nature. It's probably because we human folks have come around. Heh, <laughs> didn't think pirates had that sentimental side. And name of David Jones, what have we done? Okay, we should be able to go check on Kid now. So let's go on over here, the Gildo. What what's going on? Where where's kid? Don't tell me she Sir, it's not your fault. What are you guys all doing there? Oh, it's been a while, eh? But what's with the astonished looks on your faces? Huh? What? Where was I? Oh, I complained about this stupid gown. But then they hid me on clothes somewhere to stop me from trying to escape. So I had no choice but to walk around the village looking like this. Anyway, what's up with you guys? Did you come back because you were worried about me? Heh, <laughs> I ain't gonna drop dead from no weak old poison like that. But I guess it's a pretty close call this time, eh? Heh <laughs> But how do you neutralize the poison? Sorry, I haven't the foggiest idea either. The doc will be back this afternoon, so let's talk. Let's ask him. The doc will be back soon this afternoon, so let's ask him the end. You are all, you here to ask me how I was able to neutralize the poison? Yeah, there's no nothing to lose by knowing now right, how, right, Doc? It was a coincidence. No, it was probably an act of fate. After you left the village, a young man came to visit me upon hearing the, of the patient's condition from a villager. He had brought a certain item with him. A certain item? You don't mean. Yes, it was Hydrohuman. He happened to have a vial of it with him at the time. Hey, Doc. Who was that guy? Do you at least know his name? I'm sorry. I do not know. He only told me that he came from that mainland. Came from the mainland? Tis. At least give me a chance to thank him. Sheesh. I hate being in debt to others. When I find him, I'll wait. When I, when I, when I find him, I'll wait. That's not what I'm going to do. That's all I know. In the end, I proved useless as a doctor. 
it was not something that could be forgiven but offer my apologies hey wait doc what's with the formality no matter what else happened you're the one that made the antidote right it would have been useless without you even we did have the right stuff thank you kid or right, stop that I'm the one that should be thanking you no worries doc well the only thing that bugs me is the guy that brought that Cuban was it hey hey I guess I caused you blokes a heap of trouble too hey don't worry about it I, I'm no good at this but thanks so what do you do is plan to do next do you intend to continue on your journey that's right we still got things to take care of we'll be leaving by tomorrow Serge has a lot of problems that he needs to solve. Then will you allow me to join your party? I would like to broaden my horizons as a doctor. Will I be too much of a nuisance to you? Whoa, having a doctor with us would be a great help. Besides, how can I turn down a request from my lifesaver? We'll be more than happy to have you along. So we got Doc. Thank you kindly. It has been late and I need to make preparations. It would probably be better if we leave tomorrow. Please rest here for tonight. So we got Doc and Kid back in the party. I see. So that's what's been going on while I've been snoozing away here. You say Viper and his mob are headed for, for Dragonia? Eh? Did you hear? Fort Dragon is the oldest ruin that the Dragon is left on this planet. From what I hear, we need the dragon's tear to activate the fort. Do you remember, sirs? It's the blue orb that was on the top of the old viper's desk. Yes, I remember. Great, so I don't have to waste my breath explaining it then. If it ain't mistaken, that orb was probably the dragon tear, which means that it's in the hands of old viper right now. I cannot believe it. The general has the dragon tear, but why? To activate the ruin. There's no doubt about that. In any case, we can't just sit back and let this happen. An impenetrable fortress surrounded by rough terrain, and I hear it also sealed with the powers of the Dragonians. Is the general trying to stop the poor Elmer with it? Even I don't know that, but I wouldn't say that is not a possibility. Then we must head to Fort Dragonia. Unfortunately, Mount Pyre is a rugged obstacle that lies in the path of the fort, to the fort. From what I have heard, the place is a fiery hell. Trying to cross the mountain unprepared would be hard going. Come to think of it, the captain said we should obtain divine protection of the water dragon. But the water source of the water dragon isle has run dry. Even the fairy said that the water dragon is no longer in this world. Does that mean we have to climb Mount Pyre on our own? Dragons, yeah. This is getting bigger than by the minute. But I think this problem can be easily taken care of. What do you mean by that? Sir, you hold the key to our problems. You heard the story from the village shaman, right? The story about the land of Genesis? Kid, are you talking about the other world? The world where a surge came from? Yeah, that's right. The situation in each world is different, right? Things missing in one world can be found in the other. If that's true, then we still have a chance, stand a chance. But how are we going to get to the other world? My amulet amulet yeah my astral amulet is the other key to solving our problem I don't know if you heard from the shaman but you need lots of power to cross the missions she said it was something about the powers of hope and will according to the shaman this amulet has that sort of power normally I would just thought she was crazy but this time maybe I ought to listen to her This amulet alone ain't enough to cross dimensions though. We need another key to make the connection between this world and the other world. 
a connection so that you're saying that surge is this key according to the shaman yeah someone that is not supposed to be in this world they're the link to a world that was severed 10 years ago the missing piece of the puzzle that's the lowdown the rest is up to you surge first we need to get that divine protection or whatever from the dra water dragon well, I don't know about you, but I probably don't need no dragon's protection to get get me through that hot water. We gotta head to the land of Gen Genesis, the place where this all began. Only you know where that is. Before we go, I leave this in your keeping for a while. But don't you dare lose it on me. And I got the Astro Emily back again. All right, let's go to the place where this all began. All right, Lena or Glenn, I might have swapped one of you guys out. It's going to be Lena. Let's see, check the elements, and we'll probably call it quits after this. All right, Graviton, let's grab about five of those. Throw a beam, about five of those. Shower for five of those. No, six of those. Uh, strength and that would come in handy. All right. Guess that's it for now. Did I get in Graviton? Yes, I did. Gravity blow, cover all. Let's grab about three more of those. Don't care for that one. All right, we're good to go. All right, we're going to save it here. We're going to call it quits. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time.